welcome to the Anne Ellis Angels YouTube channel and here are your readings for the coming week. These are general readings so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave anything else behind and I wish you a most successful and enjoyable week. I will be using my teacup tarot deck and also my time to shine deck as well. Taurus, here are your cards for this week, starting the 18th of December. And from the Teacup Tarot, your overall energy card is number 14, Temperance. This is lovely. This is a card of balance. This is a card of compromise. This is a card of mixing ideas together. And that's just what she's doing on the card, look. She's mixing all the fruits together to make this lovely fruit salad. So this is a card of talking things over. This is the card of conversation. This is the card of compromise. Your help or your hurdle, the two of wands, is all about working alongside somebody else. This is the two heads are better than one card. And you can see from the card when they both work together, that's where the success can be found. So this fits in very nicely with the compromise card, talking things over and having conversations. Your guidance here, the seven of coins says, seeds are well planted. No need to worry. Just wait, pause, have a rest. This is what the temperance card says as well. And know the success will follow in divine and appropriate timing. How can we help ourselves? This is lovely. The Wheel of Fortune is about making your positive move forward. This card shows up sometimes if things have felt a little bit stuck. Not anymore. An easy movement forward. And on the card, look, when I was drawing the illustration, I wanted to show how easy it is for her to move forward. But also the things that she's taking along with her are all very positive. Her gifts, her talents, inspiration, happiness, love and success. So moving on with all these lovely qualities. Because pulling it all together, the Ace of Coins brings in this golden opportunity. Now the Aces are all about a new beginning. And the Ace of Coins coin suit is about our material life so it can be home life work life it could be a new career a pay rise a promotion a new job um anything in that area of life she's found the keys to the treasure chest and the lovely thing is look her back is to us and she's walking towards this golden opportunity your final outcome card with the teacup tarot cards is the seven of teacups. And this is a mindfulness card. Very much asking you to look at all your options carefully. Now, that's just what she's doing. Look, she's stepping back. There are seven teacups and some have lovely things in them like flowers and stars. But there's one down here with a grumpy gingerbread man in it. And she doesn't want to choose him. So she's taking her time and she's looking at all her options. And then she's going to decide. So that's the basic picture. Let's get a little bit more information from the Time to Shine deck. Here we are. I'll put them all out. 21 of wisdom, 7 of wisdom. Another wisdom card. They're all big high energy cards. These are lovely. Oh, another one. Four out of six. Right. Let's look at all these then. So, along with the balance temperance card and the card of compromise, we have 21, the world. Now, this is a card of completing one cycle, one project, and experiencing positive moves forward. This is very much a card of celebration of a job well done in one area, and then starting off 
on the next new adventure. This is advancement. This is success. Moving forward, here we are. The Seven of Wisdom is the chariot card in traditional tarot. Literally, time to make a move forward, take action with balance and discipline. And that's lovely because following on from this wise choices card, I do get a feeling you're going to make a lovely move forward because the Wheel of Fortune is here. But it's all going to be done and well thought out. And that's a really wise way to do things. Here's your victory when you do all of that, when you do your mindfulness homework, which we'll give you later on. Victory card, literally, success, victory, and enjoying the results of your hard work. The 11 of wisdom card is the strength card in traditional tarot. And this is about being assertive, but being kind at the same time. You may have to get your point across. There may be some discussions in the compromise and conversation area of your week. And it's absolutely fine to say what your needs are. So do that. Be assertive and do it with kindness and you'll get on so much faster and go so much further. And here, pulling it all together, we have another ace. We've got the ace of coins. And the ones in this deck, the Time to Shine deck, are the aces. One of thought, keep going through a learning phase, enjoy brilliant new ideas. This is the card that brings in the clarity. You're going to find the clarity from working with other people, talking things over, taking your time and making your choices. And your final outcome card is lovely, the Four of Wisdom, Emperor in traditional tarot, here you are, showing leadership qualities, stepping up, getting organised, making your plans and being ready to enjoy this fantastic movement forward. So looking at the cards overall, your mindfulness homework, compromise, conversations, working alongside somebody else. Making wise, sensible and well thought out choices. You've done the groundwork. You've started the ball rolling and the success will come in divine and appropriate timing. Very much a sense of a new beginning, closing down one chapter, but starting another one with advancement and success and a very strong momentum forward this week we've got the chariot and the wheel of fortune so things could move forward really quite quickly this week in the best way this is you finding the clarity that you need and making the most of this golden opportunity and then planning getting organized and stepping up into this new role so what a lovely week for you, Taurus. Very much a week of moving forward, moving on and enjoying the success that goes along with that. So let's just take a final card from the mini mindfulness deck. And you've got one of my favourite cards, laughter. The sound of laughter brings a smile to your angels. Spread the love, spread the laughter. And let's really enjoy ourselves this week. So Taurus, thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Thank you even more for subscribing. It's free. Just click the button. So have a lovely week. Take care of yourselves. And I'll see you here again soon.